Yeah, man. Everything, everything, everything good. Hey, look. They saying, Jamil, where your truck at? They say, Jamil, where your truck at, man? <laughs> hey, look. Look, check it out real quick. Um, everything is, look, every, every, everything is cool. Everything is cool, man. Everybody be, everybody chill. Everything is cool. Jamil, where your truck at? I don't see your truck. Everything is cool, bro. So look, make a long story short. We over here at MDS. MDS. Morristown, Tennessee. Off Interstate I-81. Eight miles from Interstate 40. Customer freight. Drop and hook freight. Brokered freight, 75%, 78%. I parked my truck here at MDS. Everything is cool, y'all. Relax. I parked my truck here at MDS. Okay? I'm a company driver right now. They got me at 60 cents a mile. If I pull reefer loads, it's like an extra four cents on to it. And if I go in the northeast with it, it's an extra two cents on it. They run all 48 states customer freight drop and hook i parked my truck here at mds it's at, it's at the terminal we got two terminals this is one terminal where all the trailers are at the other ter terminal behind me that's where the bob tows are at my truck's there it's safe mds i told him my situation i've had a rough rough last two months spot market is trash no money on the low board and just not just wasn't making no money they said, hey, you can park your owner-operated truck. Whenever you decide to get back into it, it'll be there for you. And I can jump into my owner my, my, my truck and go as an owner-operator. Right now, bro, I don't want no deductions right now. I just want to make money and, and bank it. That's it. I don't want to pay for no fuel, no insurance, no nothing. Nada. Nothing. Zero. So I parked my truck. They put me in a 2022 Ultra Loft Peterbilt. Okay? All their trucks have Thermal King APUs. I got mine on right now, boys. It's look at the bag. Look at the bag blowing. Now you want to stop. Okay, anyway, it feels good in here. I got a I got a refrigerator. Okay, it's blowing now. Oh, I have my hand, my leg, my leg in the way. It's blowing now. I got the APU running. I was covering the vent up. Look 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 at that man. It's, it it feels good in here. I got I got a I, I got a refrigerator in here. Everything worked. Everything worked. Look at the ice box. Look at the ice box. Look at that frost. Everything working here. And um, this was just a business decision. That's all. Just a business decision. Um, just no money on the low board. Let's owner operator rates just suck all. Just suck. So I'm a company boy. No force dispatch. Everybody's cool, laid back, chill. Uh, this load I'm on right now. They do drive in and reefer, by the way. This is the drive in side of the yard. And straight ahead, if I can zoom in, you can see the reefer trailers over there. Some over there, you know, they come in and out, but um, they have reefer. That's where all the reefer trailers are over there. Great Dane reefer trailers. That's one of the local guys. I love these local drivers. They bring all the loaded trailers here. We just come in the yard, drop the hook. So I'm going to do a quick little run in North Carolina, Purdue Chicken Farms, uh, do a drop and hook. Grab an empty trailer from there. Get the load planner's gonna have another load for me. Pick up, bring to Tennessee, um, and then come on back to the yard and grab something else. Keep going, baby. Keep going. So I'm super glad I'm over here at MDS. Yes, sir. And when I'm ready, the fuel goes back down where it needs to be at for me. I'll get my truck. No big deal.